Hi guys, this is Faith and with Elegance for Less. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. I am going to do for you a series of candle holders. Now, I love candle holders, so I'm always being inspired to create candle holders. So I hope that you guys will be excited about this and desire to see creative, inexpensive, beautiful, some rustic candle holders for the rest of this week and next week. So what you're gonna need for this DIY, you're going to need some of the Dollar Tree um, champagne glasses. You will need two of these punch bowl ladles. You will need two marbles, and these are from the Dollar Tree. So these are the clear marbles, but it doesn't really matter what color you go with because we are going to spray paint. You'll need your glue, gun, and glue sticks. You'll need to be able to cut, but if you don't have one of these little gadget, no worries. I have done it several times. A few DIYs I've shared with you guys how I took an old knife, uh, a paring knife, and warm it on the stove, and it does the same thing. This just makes it easier because I have it handy at my table here. You'll need scissors. You can use whatever you want, whatever design. You can use um, gems or you can use diamond wrap or you can use this ribbon that I found at Hobby Lobby that I decided I want to go with only because it has the little silver studs there and I'm going to incorporate it into this design because I'm going to go with a black spray paint. So you will need spray paint to spray paint what the base of our candle uh, sconce on the wall. You will need two of these wooden uh, base and I purchased them from Hobby Lobby. They are three by five and four in a pack for $2.99, which is an excellent buy. You get four in the pack for $2.99, so you cannot go wrong with that. At Hobby Lobby, and you can also use a 40% coupon on it, so that's great. So the first thing we want to do is go ahead and remove the spoon. So we're gonna take our little gadget or if you're using a knife, go ahead and take your knife. Be careful, because it's very hot. Get as close to the spoon as you can possibly get to it. Now I've shared with you guys that you're going to need four of the champagne glass bottom and you have to determine where it's going to go. So I think I, I like right there. So we'll go ahead, put a generous amount of glue all over the bottom of this. going to flip it over and put it exactly where you want it to go. You're going to have to hold it in place just to make sure. Once every 
everything is dried, we're gonna go ahead and lay a generous amount of glue into the center. Then we're gonna take our marble and we're gonna place it right in the center of the glue. Let it sit and dry. I'm going to go ahead and take this outside, spray paint. If you like the way that these turned out, I love the simplicity of it. I love the way that they turned out. I hope you do as well. If you do, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and share with your family and friends. I truly appreciate your time, your support, and your comments. So please leave me a comment. Let me know what your thoughts are on this Dollar Tree wall decor. All right, I will see you on my next DIY.